weather reports usually exaggerate just in case something catastrophic happens, you know, just to come out and say, hey, you know, we warned you. Uh, but this time, <laughs> they were right. They were dead on. If not, it was actually worse than what they said. The sounds were totally different. You know, like, uh, I never heard it, the window pop in from the pressure <laughs> of the water. It sounds like, Pwah! I certainly don't want to die with 85-year-old people trying to make them swim and deal with them drowning or some other insanity. This is like, it just makes you appreciate life. Even the wind on my face that's freezing right now, it feels nice, you know? It's like, uh, it's kind of cool. You think of heroes as these big bulk men, cops, and firemen, and believe me, they are too, and they always are. But here's someone who just comes out of the blue. She calls me up when I've been evacuated, said, what can I do? The day before we had to evacuate, she called me to say, let me help you get this stuff off the terrace. She was going from terrace to terrace. Take off and go on the lower yeah. floor. Yeah. I'm going to bring yeah. Let's go. Okay. Where are we at? Six? So why don't you guys do six to one and we'll do 12 yeah. to six? You see the people come together more. You see uh, everyone going out of their way to do the right thing. You know, so it's interesting because uh, sometimes you ask yourself, why can't it be done all the time like that? You know, there's some people that bring in food and stuff for people. They can't get out. I see it like this. You know, it. it it don't make no it don't make no sense that it take you know death or a tragedy like this for people to come together and help you know and that's the main time you see people coming together to help each other is when it's a death or a funeral you know or it's a tragedy like this yeah yesterday was really sad because um people said they didn't eat in three days they didn't drink water in three days and i was like within 10 minutes honestly all the food we bought was gone it was really sad. There's ketchup in uh Put it on the pot. I got ketchup and all that stuff at home. All right, good. If I get candles, I can find it. I'm Nick. They told me Eddie for sure. They told me Edward Nicholas. Yeah. 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 We don't have no power. They're saying that they're not turning the power on for two weeks. That's ridiculous. We have no gas. We have no light, no nothing. You know, and, I'm, and number one, <laughs> you won't even believe it. I might be grown and all of that. I'm very afraid of the dog. I like to sleep with a little night light or you know, a little light or something like that. It scares me. I need a flashlight. I'm not oh, a flashlight. Okay. Oh. Okay. Thank you so Stay much. Yeah. Y'all be careful because this is my dog. <laughs>